Hi, it's Melissa with My Membership Minute on Monday, Monday, February 8th, 2016. Here's what's new and hot in your membership community this week. As we filled you in at our last motivational meetup, February and March in our community in 2016 are going to be about letting go. And that has begun all across our community. So in the weekly challenge this week, so mostly this is going to be in the daily section, so in the weekly challenge section, we are, wow, there are four people there right now. There are, we are letting go of taking it personally. And this is something that seems to have resonated with a lot of you since we have two pages of comments already. And also I think it's probably because Tim's made a big cameo in that. Uh, <laughs> he can't help himself. <laughs> oh, wait. Was I, I, I made a cameo where? Oh, the weekly challenge. <laughs> Oh, that was epic. Do you want me to read the rest? Go for it. <laughs> no, I'll let you keep going. Sorry to interrupt. <laughs> um, yeah, so if you want to watch that, everybody thought he was hilarious in the weekly challenge. And then in the meditation group as well. Let's see. Oh, gosh. Here we go. Uh, right here in the meditation group, Michelle has a lovely reflection for you this week. Uh, on, uh, sorry, th that was last week's equanimity. This week, time for reflection. She has a lovely reflection um, on uh, letting go that also supports our letting go focus here. And then we're going to go back to the daily practice section in the devotional section here. Ivy has a new offering on letting go of attachment to control outcome. Letting go of attachment to control an outcome. So you can watch that there. And then also in our book club, and this is just in, it's not in our daily section, but if you scroll all the way down to, um, here we go, the study and reading groups. The membership book club. Alice and Nicole are taking you through the final chapter of Wheels of Life and Eastern Body, Western Mind. And Alice is helping you with the idea of letting go of thoughts with the crown chakra. So we're really trying to bring together the whole community with a letting go focus right now. Also, we have a new section that is going to fo focus on letting go as well. So this is also in the daily section. And this is a brand new section called Moonstruck. Uh, Michelle Israel is leading this section. So there's uh, Moon Phases 101 if you want to um, learn more about the Moon Phases. You can uh, have a look at this section. And then um, you can look at her first post here uh, with the waxing moon uh, from the new moon to the full moon and you can see uh, that section here uh, if you're interested in flowing with the face of the moon. Many of you said you were from the first section. Sorry this one's a little long this week. <laughs> Okay, so also as part of our uh, mission that I spoke about in our last meetup when I interviewed many of you and spoke about your greatest aspirations and your greatest challenges, um, part of meeting those needs is to be um, addressing relationships in a deeper way in our content in our community. So we set up a new section uh, with new content to support it. And it was so funny because uh, when Tim put this section together, um, it's called Nurturing Relationships and it's in the short video section. So we come to the short videos and uh, we go to show right here, Nurturing Relationships. There's a new uh, section here called Connecting with the Ground of Yourself. But the funny part was when he spelled nurturing wrong, uh, he went to autocorrect it, and the autocorrect went, uh, said bu butchering relationships. And I just thought that was so funny. <laughs> so I think from now on, I'm going to think of this as the butchering relationships section. <laughs> 
<laughs> anyway, um, connecting with the ground of yourself is the, the first series in the nurturing relationships section. Uh, where we hopefully won't butcher your relationships. And we're kind of introducing this not in order because I needed the third video in this section to uh, get you going in the weekly challenge. I've already filmed the first five. So um, trusting the ground of your self guided meditation is the one that I released with the weekly challenge. And this one is a great uh, support for the weekly challenge of letting go of taking it personally. Um, it, when we let go of taking it personally, we come to trust ourselves in a really uh, much deeper way. Um, but also it's a really great uh, accompaniment uh, support to this week's Namaste Yoga class on equanimity, which there was tons and tons of feedback to, which I wasn't surprised about. So if you are looking to go a little bit deeper with that class as well, uh, this is a great meditation, really short, nine minutes. So super great one for those mornings. Okay, I've talked long enough this week. Um, I hope you like our new butchering relationships series. <laughs> and all about the butchering. <laughs> uh, I think uh, laughing laughter is the best medicine, and uh, um, sometimes it really feels like I don't know about you, but I feel like I'm just totally butchering my relationships as much as I'm trying to nurture them. So. Um, the Nurturing Relationship Series I'm really excited about and we're starting with ourselves, connecting with the ground of ourselves. Namaste.